The Chevrolet Corvette C5 um, was the last of the Corvettes to have pop-up headlamps. Since then, it's had fixed units, um, which I think I'm right in saying uh, would make the car better for safety for pedestrians, I guess. It was also the last Corvette to be fully equipped with the 5.7 litre V8, as every other Corvette uh, was built with either a 6 litre a six or a 6.2. But how will this car, the Z06, compare against the Ferrari 355 or the Lotus Esprit? To find out, we have to hand it over to our feral racing driver. Rumour has it, it lays eggs, and that it can speak fluent duck. All we know is, it's got the pigeon. And it's off. Now, at 415 horsepower, it's the most powerful of the three. But how will that power translate to um, around the um, track? Now, into the first corner, it's doing okay. Well, a bit of a wiggle on the way out, but. Oh, Miss Lockton. Into Chicago corner. There he is, oversteer on the way out. These pigeons really enjoying themselves in this car. Right, into the hammerheads. Will it understeer? Will it oversteer? Quite a bit of oversteer there. How they do here? Very fast. Ooh, that's a, that's a big wiggle. Now into the Dumbledore corner. Lots of oversteer here. Whoa! And across the line in a 124.8. So the Corvette was unfortunately 0.2 of a second slower than the Ferrari, therefore declaring it the slowest car around our track. Still, a lap time of 124.8 is respectable, and we will um, have a look at the next car that goes around our track in the next video, and we'll see you then. Bye bye.